are you, lady? That doesn't look like, who are you? That looks like he's calling her something very inappropriate, which is hilarious that they decided to use that contraction in this specific situation. Gory tanks, we fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu playthrough. If you haven't enjoyed the series so far, don't forget to drop a like, and if you haven't picked up a Batty Bad t-shirt yet, make sure you get that link down in the description below because they're probably gonna sell out, so you wanna make sure you get one before they are gone. But now that I've covered that, I haven't done a thing off camera since I finished recording the last episode. And so we're just gonna battle these other couple gym trainers and then heal our Pokemon and then solve the gym puzzle and then move on. So uh, I'm I'm actually like, I think we're gonna actually be end up being a little under leveled for this gym, which I wasn't really expecting. The rocker just has a megaphone. That's, that's the thing? I thought they had guitars. Why does he just have a megaphone? That's random. Um, but yeah, so... Like, I mean, this is the gym trainer's Pokemon. I'm a little bit worried about the gym, but, like, if we're a bit underleveled, it's fine. Like, it'll make the battle more interesting anyways, so... I'm okay with that. Oh! LOL! <laughs> Idiot! <laughs> that was amusingly dumb of him. Dig. Fine by me. I really like that Pikachu outfit. I'm glad I happened to go in there. Jubilee's ahead of me in the playthrough at the time of me recording this. And I don't actually know if she went and got the EV outfit. I should mention that to her after I finish recording this. Also, I saw a picture of the the EV outfit in, um, like, because, you know, obviously in Let's Go Eevee, it gives you the EV outfit instead of the Pikachu outfit. And it looks so much worse, <laughs> in my opinion. It's just all brown, whereas I get this colorful, bright yellow, you know? I definitely do not regret my choice of game. Because Eevee's adorable, but its color scheme is just, it's so bland, you know? Which it kind of has to be, it's a normal type, but... I get brighter colors as a result, which I like. Uh-oh! Okay, that doesn't actually do too much, so that's okay. Haha! It's really nice not having to worry about static, I must say. In past in, in past games with Tenant Search's gym, you always end up paralyzed at some point or other, but now you don't have to I don't have to worry about it, and it's great. Alright, we gotta go heal. Oops. And then we're gonna take on Surge after I solve the puzzle, but the puzzles should be pretty trivial, so. Right. What is that? I just noticed that bodybuilder or black belt, whatever he is, sitting on that bench there, and I'm kind of curious. I don't think I talked to him. I think I talked to everybody else in the town, but I don't think I talked to him, and I want to know what he does. What does he do? Does he give me... I wonder if he'll give me free things. Okay... Let's go talk to this guy for curiosity purposes. Which Pokemon do you prefer, the puppy Pokemon Growlithe or the Scratch Cat Meowth? I prefer Growlithe. You didn't have to answer. I knew the answer. Sorry, it was a stupid question. If you catch five of the puppy Pokemon Growlithe, I'll give you a great Pokemon. You can ride on its back. Ah, oh. okay. Um, I can ride on the back of whatever Pokemon he gives me. Now I'm like really curious what he's gonna give me. I think I'll do it after I beat the gym. Um, cause I said I was gonna go beat the gym, but I am very intrigued as to what it's gonna be. <laughs> nope, there's only trash here. I've seen that phrase used in so many memes. <laughs> Alright, 
one. Oh, that sucks. I have to get the next one correct. Does the switch only appear after I press the first one? Okay. All right, cool. What's the point of the blue and... What's the point of the blue and red ones? That's weird. Okay, let me make sure I'm all good. We got guy in front, that's what I want. All right, let's fight this guy. Sub, dude. Dan Hut, welcome to the Vermilion City Gym. Will you look at that, a pint size challenger. Haha, <laughs> you've got big and brassy nerves to take me on with your puny power. Pokemon battle is war. I'll show you, civilian. I'll shock you into surrender. Here we go. I was kind of hoping they'd make him, like, comically large like he was in the anime. Remember in the anime, Lieutenant Surge looks like he's, like, nine feet tall. <laughs> he's, like, more than twice the height of Ash. And Ash is supposed to be pretty short because he's a kid, but, like, Lieutenant Surge is just comically oversized. Oh, that did a lot. No, no Kiero. It's level 25. This is his first Pokemon, it's level 25! Oh no. Still O code! Alright, awesome. Alright, gotta remember light screen is up. <laughs> Beat a Pokemon two levels higher than me, and that's all the experience I get. Raichu! Gonna write you a love song. All right, dig again. Oh. Holy crap! The second one was a crit. We lived with one. Oh no! So close. All right, well, he definitely heals this turn, so we're gonna do the same. He didn't heal. I can't believe that. Oh, come on! Are you serious? Oh, no. God, that miss was so unfortunate. It's fine. I taught... I taught Mew Dig because of the chance of this happening. Hopefully whatever his last Pokemon is can be easily handled by a dig. I know our attack is lowered. Oh, this guy wants to learn Psybeam. I looked up Venonat's level up moveset in this game, and it's horrible. <laughs> it's so bad. It, like, doesn't learn a special poison move at all by level up. And... It doesn't learn a special stab bug move, bug buzz, until like level 47. Oh, Magnemite! Okay, we, sh we should be able to beat this with Dig. All right, we won. Man, there were some, there were some tight moments in that. It was a bummer that, that Geodude went down. That freaking rock throw miss was so sad. But we still won. Now that's a shocker. You're the real deal, kid. I don't know why I just did that. 
Bye, and then take a Thunder Badge! High five! That's not all you're special, kid. Take this. <laughs> Excuse me? I did not ask for your autograph. That's not all I'm giving you. What? What? Did he just really? Did this guy really just give me his autograph without me asking? Oh, I got the Thunderbolt TM. Oh, I should teach that to Mew. Hey, Pikachu. You... You didn't do anything. What is... Oh, secret techniques. Oh, I can view them. This is how I... This is how I use them without, like, clicking on the thing. Aww. All right. Well. Let's teach Thunderbolt to... To Mew. Unlikely I will ever use it. Well, I mean, it's a 90 base power special move. Probably actually will use it. I'll go to Seismic Toss. Alright, cool. Let's go catch some Growlithe. Get whatever that reward is for that, uh, that guy. That, that dude. Misty? Oh, it's you again! Oh, so you beat Lieutenant Surge? You must be pretty good! Glad to see you're really learning a thing or two, and your Pokemon must have tried their best. Oh. Oh, me? I'm gone swimming in the sea. There are times we just want to break free from a puny little pool and swim in the big blue. Where are you headed next? Oh, you've been to Diglett's Cave. It's pretty close by. If you haven't been, I can show you the way. Want a guide? Uh, no. Oh, well, that's some way to turn down such a... <laughs> I... No, I know where to go! Are you... I'm not being rude! Come on, Misty! Well, now I just feel bad. I just did that completely useless thing so that a fictional character would not be upset with me. <laughs> why do I do why do I do this to myself? <laughs> Alright, let's find some Growlithe. Oh. There we go. Come here, bucko. Oh crap! Alright, well now I can see if Pokemon remain on the route after a trainer battle. Of course it's tentacle. And I'm leading with a TOD. Loving it! Just simply loving it. We can use Thunderbolt on Catra for the first time, so I guess that's a possibility. Go, Catra! Constrict. What? <laughs> All right. We took care of that. The Growlithe is still there. Okay, that's nice to know that. Trainer battles don't disrupt that. All right. So I moved my switch today uh, so that it's over there instead of over there. <laughs> and hopefully this makes my motion controls better. Alright, I don't know if I have to get a catch combo of five with Growlithe, or if I just have to, um... 206, wow, excellent throws really buff up the experience you get. I don't know if I have to get a, uh... Ah, no. 
I don't know if you have to get a catch combo or just five total. We'll, we'll see. There we go. Come here, come here, come here. Dude, stop running away from me. <laughs> Oh, just short. There we go. God, I hate that, like, excellent throws can be broken out of so easily. just not fair. Like, basically, like, if you, in Pokemon Go, if you get an ultra, or if you get an excellent throw, it's only breaking out if it's, like, a legendary, basically. Or, like, a high, like, evolved Pokemon. But, like, these... Come on! You've gotta be joking! So far, my biggest gripe with the game is how difficult the the capturing is. I've gotten three excellent throws on this stupid Pokemon. Four, and it's broken out of all of them. Jesus! This is absurd! It's sh Pokemon should not break out of excellent throws this easily. I'm going to kill someone. <laughs> I hate that. That's not acceptable. It should not be that hard to catch Pokemon. Ugh. I'll get over it, but I'm just so annoyed by that. Maybe it's not, maybe I don't have to get a catch combo of five. Maybe I just have to get like five total. I can view how many I've caught. I've caught four. So I think if I catch one more, I'm good. Lots of Pidgeotos here. Just one more growl. Oh, there we go. All right, you are not gonna run from me. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> Okay, I think now if I go back to the guy. Oh, come on! <laughs> Gosh dang it! No! Stop! Why are you like this? All right, this is something, who do I have in front? Of course I have Ivysaur. <laughs> oh, this has been a frustrating last few minutes. That freaking Growlithe breaking out of four excellent throws and then fleeing is just so cruel. <laughs> I just like, it should be more like Pokemon Go, you know? Like it should be like, if you get an excellent throw, it's basically guaranteed. <laughs> God, the killed that thing. <laughs> some great balls back. Alright, 
let's talk to this guy before we move on. Let's see what he got for us. Okay, it wasn't a catch combo. I got Persian! Did he say I could ride on the back of this? Why did I make you catch puppy Pokemon and give you a Scratch Cat Pokemon? Because I wanted to see if your preference would stay the same, even after seeing so many Growlithe. <laughs> okay, that's fine. I want to, like, put this Persian in the party. It's level 16. Adamant Nature. He said I could ride on it? Yeah, we're gonna change your name. This is like another freaking cat. <laughs> um, we'll call you... We're gonna call you Tony after Tony the Tiger. It's not a tiger, but it's the first thing that popped into my head. So we're gonna... That's what we're gonna go with. Um, party... I can't believe Persian's large enough to ride on. Oh my gosh. I feel like freaking He-Man right now. This is awesome. Doesn't He-Man have like that tiger thing that he rides on? I, I knew you could ride on Arcanine, but Persian? I was not expecting Persian to be large enough to ride. That's awesome. Persian's gonna stick around just so I can like keep riding on it. Ride gloriously into battle on the back of a house cat. All right. To Diglett's cave. This is so fun. You move so much faster. And I am blazing through here. How have I only seen one Diglett in here? That's weird. Hello. Okay, it's a little choppy at times when there's people nearby. But overall, it's still cool. We're back on Route 2. Michael! I remember one of Professor Oak's assistants. So glad I ran to. Actually, no, it's a little too bright here. Inside, I'll be waiting to show you. Too bright. Is this where I get Flash? Da dun So you came! So you came! <laughs> now let's get bound to Brass Tacks. I've got something good to show you. Believe it or not, I've mastered the Secret Technique Light Up. Okay, this is Flash. Yeah, Pikachu wants to learn it instead of me. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, cool. I'm glad I came over here because we got Rock Tunnel to go through next. Since they're not moves. Alright, is this his kid? Alright, let's see what else we can poke around and see. Oh, Trace? Or Josh? Did you learn how to use Light Up from Professor Oak's assistant too? What? You didn't learn it, but Pidge did? Party of yours really is amazing, Michael. You know what? I actually know some place where you'll be able to use it. Want me to take you there? Uh... Nah. Okay, just in case though, let me give you directions. Hedy's from Cerulean City. Yeah, I just... I, I, I normally would, but I want to like see what's down here. You know? I mean, I realize now I have to go by foot, but like, 
I feel like there's still gonna be something good here. <laughs> okay. I'm really gonna be upset if I wasted a free trip to Cerulean City. Oh, no, I got something. A leaf stone. Okay, that's actually useful. Super potion. Okay. Alright, well. Guess let's head back on uh, the back of my glorious steed. That's so funny. I can't believe you can ride on Persian. I wish you would have, like, hung around until I asked to go. What's faster? Going through here and going through... Nah, I have to go through Mount Moon if I do that. Yeah, it's definitely faster if I, like... Maybe? At least it's a straight shot if I go this way. There are some diglets. Whoa. Oh, Zubat. Okay. I forgot Zubat could be found in here. It runs so cool. Persian is dramatically growing on me as a Pokemon now that I have had this experience of riding around on it. That's so cool. <laughs> All right. Let's get out of here and go back to Cerulean City. Should I stock up on stuff at the Mart? I, I, I should just check at least. Wait, do I have a nugget to sell? I think I might have a nugget to sell. I do. Okay. Um, I'm here to buy it. Should buy more Great Balls, because clearly Pokeballs just suck now. I wish I could buy berries, though. How many Super Potions do I have? Ten. Buy a couple more. Don't want to completely, like, exhaust all my funds, but... I'll buy some lures, though. Those are cheap. Those are pleasantly cheap. Alright. On the road again! Just so glad to be on the road again! Right in the back of my per 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 -gen. Definitely should have cut that off sooner than I did. <laughs> should have filled more words so I could end the line with Persian instead of having... And then didn't have to repeat per 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 over and over again. Oh, it doesn't let you ride Pokemon in here? That's dumb. I was looking forward to a big fun straightaway. Who cares if I ride it? How dare, game. I am deeply offended that you don't allow my normal-sized house cat to run inside of that cave. An Abra! Oh wait, no, I changed routes. Dang it, now it's gonna be gone. I think I might need to like, if I wanna try and catch an Abra, I don't think I can like, I think I have to sneak up on it, right? All right. I only got one shot at this. God, freaking. Okay, I made contact. Hopefully that's enough. It's a green circle. No! Oh, it didn't automatically flee. Okay, I guess the fleeing aspect is like prior to the battle. Nice! 
We got our first Abra. Awesome. I got a large smart candy for that. Whatever, whatever stat that boosts. Sleeps 18 hours a day. Golly gee. I keep forgetting that. Awesome. All right. Well, now we can put uh, we can bring Tony back out of the out of the ball. I want to check out my candies. Like, what do I have? Smart candy. Special attack by one. Ooh. Levels too low. Okay, you can't use large candies. Interesting. Three candy to go up by one. Goodness. Um, I guess we'll give... We'll give it to Mew. I know Mew's gonna stick around for a while. Mighty Candy's physical attack? We can give some to, uh, to Gaia. Oh, Gaia might evolve this episode, actually. And I'll need to recruit Jubilee to trade with me. Sweet. Oh, I have so many of these. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Button mash! Special defense. I guess I'll give it to, to Mew. Might as well just... Because, like, there's no limit. There's, like, a limit of, like, what, 200 in each stat? So it, like, doesn't really matter who I give it to. <laughs> snuck up on the Abra. Okay, yeah, Abras just have to be snuck up on. I'm very, I'm very bad. Oh, cool! Let me go. Awesome. All right, now let's actually go to the other places. Dun. I think there's a tree I can chop down up on the on the north route for an item. And I want to go get that item, whatever it is. Route right where I got the shiny Venonat. Man, that's annoying. How close do you have to get? I feel like the, the shut-off distance for Persian being shut off should be smaller. Definitely really <laughs> kind of awkward just having Persian like appear and disappear in these small spaces Thunder wave, okay, not as good as I was hoping but whatever now Let's just go back here Take the shortcut back. I do like how quick it moves though. It's like twice the speed of like me on foot Cut through this person's house. Hello, don't mind me. Just using your home as a pass-through location. All right, and now... Oh yeah, this all connects. Now we just go to the tree to cut it. Wild Meat Arena, that's cool. All right, trainer battle times. <laughs> what up, Alicia? I have something weak to a like, or yes, Evie's fine. I think I should just switch to Pikachu here. Double kick it. Da -na -na. Oh. 
Actually, Thunderbolt is still stronger. I keep forgetting that. Mm -hmm. Dang it, so close. I guess I'll just double kick this time. Yeah, it's not gonna heal. Yeah, boy. <laughs> That's like Eevee's call now. Is yeah, boy. <laughs> Yeah, boy! Gloom. Well, unfortunately, my electric attacks are useless against this thing, but I also don't have it. They're not useless. I just I have, like, no good attacks against grass types right now. It's resisted, but, like... Should have like a flying type on the team. Uh, freaking grass types. Erica's gym, I am extremely unprepared for. Because <laughs> I looked at Mew's level up moveset and it doesn't get like, it should have gotten confusion at level one. I don't know when, why mine didn't have it. Maybe because they're like the event one. We're like, we're not gonna make this thing too OP early on, but I can't, I basically can't teach it a psychic stab until I get to, um, Celadon and get the psychic TM, because it learns psychic by level up at level, like, <laughs> learns psychic by level up at level 77! I've got spare regular potions, so I can heal Pikachu back up. I prefer to use, like, the worst potions when healing between battles. You know, save the better ones for when you need to revive a lot more in one turn. Alright, awesome. Big Onyx! Jubilee caught multiple Onyx in Mount Moon and saw, like, multiple Clefable and Clefairy. And I was like, how did you get so much better spawns in Mount Moon than me? Because I saw, like, I didn't see any Onyx, and I only saw, um, that one Clefable and one Clefairy. Maybe I spent all my spawn luck on the shiny. <laughs> and when do you learn Razor Leaf? Oh, that's like if you go down the ledge and you have to backtrack, I see. We'll just battle this guy now. For the heck of it, and he's a hiker, and I already have ivory sore in the front. And I tend to fight hikers with my grass type, because they like to use rock Pokemon that are weak to grass. I really do sing, like, constantly in this <laughs> in playthroughs. Bye, you, dude. Man, they're like, the experience growth curve is so slow. They really do expect you to just spend a buttload of time catching Pokemon. Because battling trainers is like, very slow leveling up. <laughs> One trainer Pokemon gives me like, what? Is that like a 20th of a level? Aw, oh, man. There we go. Take care of that dude. Oh, I love the mountains in the background. The blurry mountains, like, in the back of the, the battle environment. Those look so good. Alright. Oh, an Inoran male! I haven't found one of these yet! I need to catch this dude. Mm. 
That wasn't excellent? That was such a small circle. There we go. I have noticed it's it's like I'm ha I'm having fewer issues now that I moved my switch to be like more in front of me. Like I'm I haven't I've yet to have an issue where it just goes like over there for no reason at all. So that's nice. Alright, got our first Nidoran mail. That's cool. There's a Nidorina here and now it's gone. An ether. That's probably a trainer. Probably uses bugs. Yep. <laughs> I don't know why I said probably uses bugs. It's clearly a bug catcher. Obviously he's gonna use bugs. <laughs> oh crap, it's a grass type one. Hopefully rock slide still KOs. It should. Rock Slide's strong. Yep. Alright, cool. Bye, Paris. Alright. That was no problem at all. Whoa, Need Arena. This is gonna break that Need Arena catch combo, but I don't care. I'm not going for a catch combo. Definitely wanna try and catch this thing. Man, I only have nine raspberries? How do I have so few no raspberries? How do you get, how do I get more berries? <laughs> yes! All right, at least I only need to use one berry on it. Oh, lots of experience. Wait, oh, Guy's gonna, Guy's gonna evolve, right? It evolves to level 25, right? Yeah! Now I need to trade with Jubilee. Awesome! Your Guy evolved into Graveler, yeah. That's awesome. Sweet. And now need arena, huh? All right, cool. I probably won't evolve it like this episode. I need to like get Jubilee's attention and have her come over here. Um. All right, I've seen what's here. We we can move on a little bit more. Fight me! I want to use my new Graveler for the first time. Camper Drew. Ah, man. Not a fantastic matchup. Look at how round it is. Zora, if you could learn, like, Mega Drain like a special grass move, that'd be greatly appreciated. <laughs> because Vine Whip is not ideal right now. <laughs> I mean, I'll get a good grass team from Erica, I'm sure. But it's just like, Vine Whip is not gonna cut it because I have an attack lowering nature. And Vine Whip's not very strong. It's only like 45 power. Eradicate. We're gonna switch for this. This thing tends to know, like, we'll use Gaia for this. Resist any attack. I mean, well, it might go for, like, Bite or Crunch, which we won't resist, but we have high defense, so it shouldn't do much. Ow. That's fine. That's not annoying. Oh, man. 
We're gonna go for rock throw so we don't lose more. Okay, at least I know I can't KO. <laughs> Haha, you suck, Radicate. 304 experience. That's way better than normal. Super potion. Okay. Oops. <laughs> Who are you? That's a nice Pokemon you're walking with. Oh, you mean my glorious tiger? That's just a house cat that I can ride. Oh, cool. Good matchup. Definitely will Oko this. Boom! Diglett is so freaking frail, it's hilarious. I Okay. <laughs> First matchup was great. Second matchup, not ideal. <laughs> Only hit twice. Okay, cool. I bet I can still K KO with Zippy Zap. Yep. <laughs> Real quick KO. <laughs> Woo, we got it. Guess we'll catch this Nidoran for giggles. Come on, could you actually catch with an excellent throw for once? Thank you. <laughs> More experience. Bonus multiplier 3.3, man. First throw excellent throws give you a good chunk of experience. Awesome. Let's get a move on. Already fought that guy. A black belt. Oops. How did he not see me my first time walking past him? I don't know. What? Black Belt Bryce. What you got for me? All right, we, we just Thunderbolt this thing and move on. <laughs> Catcher doesn't have any psychic moves, but it will resist any attacks from this thing. Booyah! Cool. We're almost to the Pokemon Center, I think. Well, that took 10 years for her to walk over to me. <laughs> All right, Caitlyn. Caitlyn. You spelled your name wrong. I know Caitlyn's whose name start with K. Right, Caitlyn's one of those names that has like a billion different spellings. Of all the common names out there, I feel like Caitlyn has the most spelling variations. You know? Like I'm trying to think of a different one, and I'm having difficulty. Rachel has like A E L and E L, but like Caitlyn, you got like. Caitlyn has so many. <laughs> I 
Good for you, Tony. I appreciate you being my loyal steed. Actually, I'm tempted to re-nickname... Yeah, I'm actually gonna do it. I'm changing Tony's name to Steed. For he is my loyal steed. Glorious. Welcome to Route 10. Nidoran. Oh, a little closer. It's about a potion! Oh. What is this rocket grunt doing here? Oh my gosh! It's because of you that Team Rocket's reputation was totally smashed! Well, I'll never be able to face the boss at this rate. Which means we'll have to take our revenge on you. I have to about to battle... Oh my gosh. Hold it. Whoa, what? Ho 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 ho! Lorelei! Ganging up on a child, I absolutely can't forgive that. Damn! Who are you, lady? That doesn't look like, who are you? That looks like he's calling her something very inappropriate, which is hilarious that they decided to use that contraction in this specific situation. <laughs> we'll gang up and take you on too! I'll handle these three. Could you take that other one for me? Leave it to me. Good answer! Now then, let's go. Damn, Lorelei. Whew. Whew. Is it hot in here? No, it's cold in here because it's Lorelei and she uses ice types. Eradicate! Watch, she's like, I'll protect this kid. <laughs> kid busts out a mew. What? <laughs> oh. It's fine, we... Took that incredibly well. Wow, okay. I use Scald for the second one just for fun. I've yet to get a Scald burn, but I also haven't used Scald all that much, so. Oh, the boss hears about this! That she got obliterated by an Elite Four member? I mean, to be fair. Jeez, kid, just how strong are you? Even three of us rushing you wasn't enough. Those incredibly powerful Ice-type Pokemon. Who are you? I am Lorelei of the Pokemon's Elite Four. Shall I freeze you all solid too? She's so cocky and awesome, oh my god. Elite Four, we surrender! <laughs> You're a pretty talented trainer. It was plain to see you during, it was plain to see during your battle. I see, so you're collecting gym badges. I look forward to when you come to challenge the Pokemon League. Until then, see ya! Bye. <laughs> Persian just busts back out of the ball. <laughs> Alright, let's heal the squad. We got a bit of time, we can hop into Rock Tunnel. Awesome. Alright, what Pokemon... I just saw, like, one Nidoran show up. I want to see if there's, like, other Pokemon that show up at the top there. Oh, boy. Alright, Persian. I think I'm gonna have to... Give you, give you a little break. Zora can travel alongside me. I haven't seen Ivysaur outside of battle yet. Three Great Balls. Nice. Alright, this... We should battle this, uh, oops. Keep hitting the wrong button. All right, battling the attractive coach trainer. Tasha. Gosh dang it. 
Not a great lead. Gaia and uh, Zor have like basically caught up with Pikachu and Mew though, so that's cool. Tank that very well. Learn a better move, Ivysaur, please. <laughs> Oh, thank God that missed. That would've been annoying. God, that's all I can do? Zor, you need to learn something other than Vine Whip. Learn, like, even Mega Drain would be fine. Or Absorb, even. <laughs> well, actually, I don't know about Absorb, but. Ow. Care of the Poliwhirl. A lot of experience. Agility? No thanks. I've got a lot of experience. Priming. Hey, dude. That hurts. But at least I have speed, so this is fine. And we're right next to a Pokemon Center. <laughs> 26. Cool. Way to go, youngster. Turns out you taught me a thing or two. Here, take this for the lesson. Oh, nice! That's a great TM. Who, can anybody learn it? I, I would really like... Can. Gaia can learn it. And Gaia's a physical attacker. Um... We'll get rid of Rock Throw. Now I have something, now I have a counter, a much more clear counter for normal types. Yeah, sweet, that's awesome. I'm glad I did that. <laughs> Is there anything down here? Five Pokeballs, cool. Oh, they altered this route a bit. Oh, there's just that trainer there, okay. I don't really wanna fight him. Whoa, Krabby! Come here! Come here! Let's catch my first Krabby. Let's see if I can do it with a regular Pokeball. I've got so many. Gosh! Oh, nice! Wow, that was awesome! I love it when that happens. Could that just happen every time? <laughs> Zor leveled up. Learn something other than Vine Whip. No! I need something other than Vine Whip, <laughs> please. I guess uh, we can try and get a little catch combo for Krabby going. Okay, I got it to go a little to the side that time. That didn't work at all. Jerk. How do you get it? I don't understand how you get it to move far enough to the side. God, the amount of times it rocks three times is just so annoying. Like, 
it rocks three times, it should be guaranteed. Oh, come on! It runs? God, I don't understand. Catch combos are not possible in this game. They're, they're just simply not possible. I've decided. <laughs> like, unless you're fighting freaking, like... Unless you're fighting freaking, what do you call it? Caterpies. Okay, well that time it worked. It's so hard, why is this so difficult? Uh. Could've had a little catch combo going, but no. All right, well, should be about time to wrap up. We're gonna battle this camper and then move on. We're gonna battle this camper and then wrap it up. Just wanna make sure, clear out all the trainers, get a bunch of money, a bunch of Pokeballs. So after this battle, we'll be done, and then we will fight, we will go through Rock Tunnel in the next episode. Oh sweet, guys in the lead, I can use a uh, Brick Break. Yeah, we take those. Take those very well. Booyah! I don't know. Nope, no, 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 wait, that's a Psyduck. That's a Psyduck. Nope, don't fight a Psyduck. Do not fight a Psyduck with a with a Graveler. Don't don't do that. The amount of times Jubilee just doesn't pay attention and, like, has her onyx out against a water or a grass type is kind of funny. <laughs> like, oh, this will be fine. Oh! Nice! Cool. Yeah! We did it! Hooray! Alright guys, well... I almost forgot I was ending the episode now. <laughs> guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to drop a like, and make sure to pick up a Batty Bad t-shirt before they are gone. And that is all I have for now. So until next time, we fans! Gotta catch them all!